mother, two boys. She's a 17 year old in Fog Tree. And, um, <coughs> okay. and um, a toddler, not really a toddler, a six year old is in the big So, and I'm 41 years old. So I, I was <laughs> So that is how good we are. We've been friends for a very long time. A very long time. For sure, it is being introduced into network marketing. Long time ago. And you know this guy. Then, when he came, he did some things which I've never seen up to date. In that organization, you recorded your work. You have to okay. Now, I'm not here to talk about Jeremy. I'm just here to encourage you to do my town. I'm, I'm a breast cancer champion. I just came out of treatment um, two months ago. Like, um, <laughs> that is when I finished my uh, entire treatment took one year. Uh, surgery, mastectomy, chemotherapy, and radiotherapy. And now I'm doing something called um, homotherapy, but it will take like 10 years. So, but uh, the major thing, I just came out like two months ago. I was diagnosed first of August last year, 2022, and I was diagnosed again free August lunch. Wow. <laughs> I am breast cancer stage 3B. Um, when you look at my breast, eh, they don't look balanced, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> you know, this is fake because this was removed completely. This one tried to kill me. So my breast surgeon said, you cut this and throw it to the dogs. <laughs> and I will move your leaf nose. The man will ever eat it to leaf nose with Kiko, what you like to eat? It's a guy. You know those things, eh? Yes. So this, they can't balance. See them? Why do you do it? You know, I think balance. But then that is not really an issue because I'm not my breast. I'm Nana. See them? Yes. Yes. And, and champions are not swiped away by small, small things. By like, people are going to stay at my breast, they are not. No, those things don't matter really. There's more to life than breasts. <laughs> now, um, most of you will look at me and say, Kwani and Japona, Nimepona, Kabisa, I'm in total remission, 100%. I told you. I put on this because there's something called lymphatic fluids. Because now my system was messed, gahe, so the gahe the system. It has idea of flow, margin, it's like a sewage system. So you imagine I, I flow, I may be confused, I am so poor in Akura. But then the doctor say put on a compressor with time, it uh, after two years, in two, three years, it after two years. So not that I'm sick, it's just for my comfort. And uh, to Wow. Wow. Like, I'm not even here to 
encourage you, I'm here to tell you, it is up to you. Yes. Do not wait for circumstances to push you to take this product. My, my sixth chemotherapy was very rough for me. I did um, nine, uh, eight sessions for nine months. And with the exception of being extremely expensive, because cancer is extremely expensive, my every treatment of chemotherapy was costing one fifty thousand, and I was doing in every three weeks one fifty thousand. So you can do your mathematics times eight. Eh? Now at the a test because there's something they call body works before for your chemotherapy. Like my wangali, your heart is okay, kidneys, nini, blood, what, what. I don't even want to talk about those costs, and those are things which have to pay cash. Yes, and I try to put it up, but still, you have to pay some good amount of money. And with cancer, they do not touch you. Actually, you go, you do your blood test, you pay today. Then tomorrow, you just come with the invoice. They don't touch you. So, you, one, it is a financial disorder. Two, it completely messes you up. Chemotherapy completely messes your DNA. Like, your body cannot be the same again. There are those things I did those years, but now I cannot, even if I want, because that they, those drugs, they completely screw your DNA. And now, I don't want to have another DNA. Now, during my sixth chemo, something really strange happened. I, I was... In ICU, Roger, I see you. So, and I was not in the normal ICU. I was in an emergency ICU. So, my sister, one morning, I'm just waking up, my legs are shaking, I can't start, I can't. So, my sister said, like, There's something happening to your body, you are shutting down, and we are looking at you. Kumi sugar equal 29. I have thrush, you know cancer in attack system, not your mood. So thrush if I talk from my mouth, I can't swallowing water alone. Nikama ku swallow maui. Maji. Near thrush in a term can be in a mucotosis. In a shaken every part of the body which produces mucus. Then if you don't kubwa. So the me talk a killer man in me better chin in bele and you ma killer man. So see as baba, see as the cast, see as the lala, sugar me and do. So I was taken straight. So I see you. They were saying I was going into diabetic coma. Then my eyes became blind also. Then a lady we used to go to church. She she was following my story very keenly. Her name is Florence Baina. She, she tested me and said, I, I can see you are really suffering. I, I me I was, was talking about my story and my status very much and it was very therapeutical. So she said, I know a product called 87. And and in the new product, Nana, me and I do it to that because I think it was in the state just then. Let me tell you the desperation my family was in, my siblings, because that's my number one sister, and my friends, they could buy anything and anything for me. So when I told my sister that this product, I can't literally see. Now I'm not going to glasses. So she said, Why let me do it? I can't see you. Four nights, five days. It's kind of stabilizing. I put your own products like a tomato product, but I'm not still seeing the sugars in the catalog. So it's 15, 18, 15, 18. So I'm still doing so badly. So the kind of old, sick one, I should see more. They got two apple. Then this product was good. You know the most amazing thing, this product, eh? I say, look, I'm like, what is this product? In two days' time, I was taking such it as we as we and journey as per instructions and taking a lot of water in two days time. My eyesight, matter if you can come and make even more pressure. Okay, what is that here? Okay, my eyes, this there's something straight like I can. I don't think I can glass the city because I'm I can even see the TV like clearly. And, and you can document this because this is a true. I, 
haijaongezwa chumvi haijabadiziwa in hii story tu ya ukweli it is on social media it is it is an international story because now i have an initiative which is international it is it is a story told everywhere so then yenye ni kwa nimeshindwa kutoka kwa bed you can imagine I'm on insulin and I'm still on chemotherapy. I was telling God, you cannot be serious. To terminal illnesses, you have to choose a struggle for me. You know what I'm just like literally. But then God is easy. You guys are more like I'm a bestie. Who's our friend? So I'm like, you have to choose a struggle for me, my friend. You cannot let this happen to me. Cancer, then diabetes. No, no, no. So I continue with this product. Then after four days, we can have to talk about it. So she shiki, she shikui, na hamu kapekiamu. Kasi akanikuwa po kakuigia in my bathroom, ni kakapanda, you know. Slowly, slowly, slowly. I'm telling you, this thing did magic to my life. We can never go to me, we can never go to me religiously. By the time I'm in the hospital, like, why we go to go to But you look so good. So look I see you just the other day. I'm like, and so, and I'm telling you, there's power in this something. Yes. All my journey, even before me, I'm a user of supplements. Even before I was diagnosed, I, I know these things they play a big role. Because you cannot get everything in our foods. Again, the foods we are eating is so contaminated, you don't know what is in it. So you need something to give your body more strength. Now, so this thing, this one, it is so religious. And actually, I even just started out telling my friends, by the way, he gives me this, this, this thing, this thing, this thing. And, and you know, so my, most of my friends started using it because they say, Nasasa, where, where? Well, I'm going to go up, I'm going to go out of the Uma Kucha, Kutoka, and you look better than that. This is your Tunaka, I'm going to go I'm like, I'm going to go to the Kapa, but it is true. But then God gave me a new body completely. How? When I got cancer, after chemotherapy, my immune system went to zero. So I had to repeat all my bad things from BC. So, I'm not going to be Nicola Williamia. I'm going to be Nicola Williamia. I'm going to be one year old. Anyway, then I met Jeremy and the beautiful lady, Charity, up at Gini another day. So, I'm telling them my story again. He can't be able to work on bed. So, she gave me this. She was like, Can I have one day, please? I'm telling you the truth. By the time I'm finishing my radiotherapy, I was driving myself to hospital for radiotherapy. Wow. <laughs> I, my husband was at 5.30 in the morning. So I was at 4, na chomoka, na kimbia osi. It's something which takes like 5-10 minutes. By 7, we go home. Yeah, my family members were like, yeah. And you are just amazing, you know. But God helped me, but still, I, I am here to say that this product really played a role. Me, I'm okay, you need to go and I have to kill my gojo again. What was with your abusha? Because they have a tendency of saying, What do I mean? I'm going to have a I'm going to be one. I can't ask his good yards. I do want to see him going to have a I'm like, Who do you mean? Me, I'm going to have a like, No. What are you doing again? I'm like, I don't want arguments. Wakini pata uko ni kiwa kake watu na like aya. So it is true you are sick. Why? This thing, this thing, they give my body a, a new outlook, which even came up. No matter how hard it oppressed me, it is not oppressing. Chache chache. In a few days, na muka na na indelea. Na you know feeling very strong. You can imagine a cancer stage three B. A lot of people who have been diagnosed. After me, actually, like 15, I can count all night. So me, 
I am a chosen one, and I'm a very, very special child of God. I'm here to encourage you today. But, you see, let me tell you, let me give you very, very disturbing statistics, which is happening now. Um, every hour in Kenya, this country, six people are being diagnosed with cancer by oncologists in different parts of this country. That means, in the next 10 years, because the, the research shows that in the next 10 years, mortality rate of cancer is about 78%. Meaning, in every family in Kenya, there will be three people who are sick of cancer and they will die. That means you are the KU, the oncologists say, in the next three to five years, 60% of Kenyans will have cancer. Fact. And the funny thing, and the most disturbing thing, and the saddest of all, is that the cancers which are ravaging people left, right, front, and middle, they are targeting women. Because number one, cancer killer is cervical. Number two is breast, ovarian, vaginal, uterus. They are called gynecological cancer or cancers of the heart. What do I mean? Now, girls, I want you to listen. So that you know. Cancer of the heart. With the exception of this product, you have to take care of yourself emotionally. Statistics shows that any woman who has been touched by those five kinds of cancers and breast, you must have passed through a serious trauma in your life, either through divorce, separation, loss of money, loss of a child that is either miscarriage or death of a child, loss of finances, or you are in a very toxic marriage or relationship. So, let me to that <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> forgive me. <laughs> but it is the truth. Girls, my message to you is can you draw a boundary? Can you love yourself? Because me, I know where my cancer came from. Story for another day. I can say, and I can know when it started. Because I didn't draw a boundary. I didn't know when to move on, when to stop this nonsense and move on with my life. But with the exception of diet, which is number one major problem, the diet. Number two is stress. Cancer is a, a disease which is so closely related to stress. Because what happens to your body? When your body becomes acidic, cancer cells thrive in acidic, not cancer alone, any kind of disease thrives in acidic environment. Yeah? Because stress produces a hormone called cortisol. And cortisol fights your immune system. You understand? Mm -hmm. So you are there. She says to the channel, my share to the fact that I share my born or talk to me. Well, I have to work a candle. So what are you doing to your body? You know, you are enhancing all these things. Number two, your body is, you are eating so much sugar with products quails, milk, fine carbohydrates, these things, they produce a lot of mucus. And cancer cells love mucus and sugar. So, already your diet, of course, you don't have stress, and I said, you don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry about it. And those people you are even thinking about, they are not even, they, they don't care about your life, actually, literally. I'm sorry, but it is a truth. Because, Trust you, me, women, our biggest enemies and problem. They are the children that we sire. All our daughters to Naza. Now I'm a one or two. Don't be born there. I tell you. You You either like it or not. So you have to take care of yourself. Invest in yourself. Every day you wake up. Buy supplements. As you go to buy those clothes, lipsticks, do you need any matama? Nothing to wear 
Self-love. Number one. Self-love. Self-love. Number one. Self-love. Self-love. Number one million. Self-love. Number one million. Self-love. Thank you. Wow. 